Ethereum, that blockchain just got a lot of press about the fact that it did switch to proof of stake. And the number we keep hearing is that that cut its energy usage by 99%. And we've asked this question in a few different ways to a few different people, but I'd love to hear your thoughts on why Bitcoin can't just switch from proof of work to proof of stake. Yeah, a couple of thoughts come to mind on that topic. You know, first, yeah, I've, I've seen the same statistic that Ethereum has reduced its energy consumption by 99% by switching to proof of stake. But the fact is, is that energy consumption is still there. You know, the, Ethereum might not be using it in the form of its consensus system, but all the GPUs out there that we're mining for Ethereum now are just going to do something else. They're going to mine another coin. They're going to be sold to gamers. They're going to be used for AI, machine learning. The, the, the price of these things didn't go to zero. So the energy consumption net net hasn't changed whatsoever. Proof of work drives security for something so important as money. Proof of stake maybe works for other applications, but Bitcoin will never change from proof of work to proof of stake. Um, if anyone wanted to make that change, the development of Bitcoin is completely open. Someone could propose that code and they could see the consensus that it reaches. I'm optimistic it won't get much support. So let's just put that on the record. Bitcoin never going to go to proof of stake. We've established that. All right. Interview, interview over. Done. Done. No, not done. <laughs> You're not done. <laughs>